Hello guys and welcome to episode number 3 of my Inform Isco Road to Glory. If you did miss the last episode, we did manage to make a personal rage at the end of the last game. And the, we are going to make an upgrade and that being Gaia, our left back. We do pick him up for around 1,100 coins. Before we continue on, drop a like, subscribe if you're new, everything does help. And leave some feedback in the comment section down below. And let's go into this episode as you can see we did pick up a guy for 1100 coins or for 1300 coins I did want to pick up a fresh one so that's what I did and I, the reason I chose guy was our left back position was a bit lacking I did say in the last episode that I did choose to do the, um, the left mid right place first which which would give us more chemistry later on when we upgrade the center back but as you can see guy there 82 pace very nice defending as well and we go into the game against a strange BPL team. He did have Mario Goetze stuck in the central mid position, getting no chemistry. He did have Markovic in central mid, and he did have Daniel Sturridge out on the left. Not quite sure what he was doing there. I guess he just wanted more pace in his team. But he did have Balotelli up top. And he was actually a strong player in the 17th minute he was on the attack. He won to his Goetze and Balotelli manages to score. And after that goal, he just ran around the whole pitch. I'm doing this celebration for a long period of time. He's on the attack in the 20th minute once again. Moreno passes it to Sturridge. Another one to Balotelli. He gives him some space and he puts a pass to keeper. And once again, he proceeded to celebrate running around the pitch. He's on the attack in the 40th minute once again. Balotelli passes it to Oscar. Oscar dribbles, passes it to Balotelli. And once again, Balotelli puts a near post. Keeper definitely should have just saved that. Even though he is a bronze ball, he definitely should have been saving that one. And then in the 53rd minute, he's attacking once again. Mar this time it's Markovic. He manages to score a nice little finesse goal, making it 4 0. And then he scores from a free kick. Def the keeper once again probably should have saved that, but free kicks are a little unpredictable this year. And so after that, I just stopped, dropped the control and stopped playing. But we did manage to get still promotion, which is why we are having an upgrade made to the team. And that is going to be Alvaro. Alvaro is a central back, centre back fr from the Liga BBVA as that, and he does have some nice pace and defending, which is why I chose him. And we also make another upgrade, being Jesus. I said at the start of the speak of the uh, start of the series that promotion gives you one upgrade, but it's, it's actually two upgrades, as promotion is is a hard thing to do, and winning the title gives you three upgrades. So we do put both of them in the team. As you can see, the Alvaro 74 pace, 71 defending, and in Gosby of Jesus. Not quite sure if we take a closer look at them, but they are pretty good players. Alvaro being one of the better centre backs for the Silver non rares and he is even better than some rare. We go into another game. He does have Sturridge and Van Persie up top, Sherlo Navis on the wing, Ozil and Mata in central mid, PK and company, Danny Alves and Lee the Lewis with the firing goals. So a very nice and dangerous attack was well, so he did a PK which is slightly weaker so hopefully I will attack him there. And in the twenty third minute twenty third twenty third minute, Jesus or Jesus makes a terrible mistake rushing out from the corner kick to clear the ball away for punch. But Van Persie manages to rise and score a goal. And then in the fifty third minute, Iskra gets tackled the ball goes to Van Persie. And he manages to score a sort of dribble past the keeper. Once again, he's a Jesus should have been doing a lot better to save that. He is a silver, but and he did manage to sort of let him to easy goals. But Isco oh, is on the run in the 82nd chance. minute. Go. Managed to do a fake shot, then dribble past two players and score near post past the keeper. So we will be add, making another upgrade to the team, which is very nice. But very nice play for Isco. With his excusing that 90 dribbling to just basically get past three players. Being company, company being one of them, and also PK. So it's 2 1 in the 80, 83rd minute, and that is how the game ended. So we do make an upgrade to the team, and that's going to be in the likes of a Uruguayan def defensive mid, Cristoforo. Cristoforo, his name, I'm not quite sure if that's how you pronounce it, but he does have nice pace, he does have medium high work rates, I do believe, and he does have some very nice defending as well for a silver card. He's currently on six chemistry due to the centre back being due to the centre back giving him a red link. But hopefully we will be able to upgrade that. Hope you guys did enjoy the episode. If you did, drop a like and subscribe. Everything does help. Leave some feedback in the comments down below. Other than that, peace. See ya.